Hello and welcome to Weekend in Norfolk. I'm Barry Weber, Executive Director of the Norfolk Historical Society. Today, we're going to take you on our virtual tour. We're going to visit several of the locations that Marie Kendall, our 19th century photographer, frequented to capture some of her more iconic images of the village of Norfolk, Connecticut. Our first stop is the magnificent Battelle Fountain. This was erected in 1889 by Mary Eldridge, who lived in the home just behind us. She hired architect Stamford White to design this beautiful fountain in memory of her uncle, Joseph Battelle Jr. The bronze on top of this beautiful fountain was designed by Augustus St. Gaudens. He often worked with Stamford White on his designs. Our second stop on today's tour is to focus on the Christ Church of Norfolk. Kendall loved the village green. She came here often. We have many, many photographs that she took of band concerts on the green and all the events that took place and the buildings around the green, as you've seen from looking at the fountain. So behind me with the church, one of the other things that Kendall loved to do was to climb the church steeple. She would climb up there with her 40 pounds of equipment, her glass plates, which she used to turn her photographs into negatives. Of course, she was wearing, you know, a complete uh, Victorian outfit. She was dressed in her, in her long skirts. And so we can imagine climbing up to the, that steeple to get her shots. She stopped at nothing. So here are two images of Marie Kendall and the views that she was so fond of taking from the steeple. Here in this view to the west, we see the Eldridge homestead and the old chapel building uh, that was torn down. And in this image, we're the same direction, we see the new, newly erected Battelle Chapel has been put into place. Here in this view, looking east, we can see all the town buildings, some of them still exist today. There's the old bank building and the village hall, which is now Infinity Hall. Another frequent subject we see in Kendall's photographs, it was a magnificent Norfolk Library, which was built in 1888 by Isabella Eldridge, designed by George Keller, who was the architect. He also designed the Soldiers' Memorial in Hartford. Kendall took these wonderful interior photographs as just as the library opened. Be sure to check out Ann Havemeyer, the director of the library's video on the history of the library, Golden or Gilded. You can find that also on the Win Weekend website. Our last stop on today's tour is the Alfredo Taylor Railroad Bridge, or Ornamental Gate. This was commissioned by Isabella Eldridge, who had also built the library. She built this in 1904. This would have originally been along the edge of the bridge. The train have, would travel, traveled underneath us at this point, and the station and haystack would have been in our backdrop. So it was an, a classic framing of an iconic Norfolk view. And here's Kendall's classic version of this iconic bridge. So thank you for joining us on this little tour. I'd like to point out two other things. We've written this amazing book about Marie Kendall, where you can learn more on her life, or you can visit our website, norfolkhistoricalsociety.org, and see our brand new 20-minute video of a virtual tour of the inside of the museum. Thank you for joining us, and we hope you had a wonderful win weekend.